Hello, my name is Roberto Pollato, and in this video I will show you how to register the voltage of an installation and how to define limits for capturing events. Here we can see the input voltage and now we can select the register option. Okay. Now we have to select where we want to store the information, the internal or external memory. We select the recording, the trend recording mode, the average time, and the limits for the events. Okay, now we can run the register and we will see on the left the evolution of the input voltage as a trend over time. We can change the voltage to see this evolution yes you see in this knob. Okay. So now the voltage is increasing. We see the evolution of the input voltage and now we have captured an event we see now how the voltage is reduced and again we see the limit and in this moment we have captured another event related to the input voltage we can play with the unit in this way registering the input voltage and when we cross the limits, the upper or the lower limits, an event will capture and in this way we will be able to see later uh, when these events have happened. Now we can stop the register And now we can check what we have registered. Just yes, select the memory. Now we select the events function. And with the arrow left and arrow right, can move from one event to another. Just yes, in a very simple way. This event function is very useful. In a very simple way, we can define the upper and lower limits so that the oscilloscope will capture the events providing information about when that event has happened and the maximum and minimum values of the voltage for the averaging period when the event has happened. 